A new study found that creatine may offset meal-induced changes in your circulation. Now, this is really important for people who eat fried foods, who go out and have pizza or really high carbohydrate foods, which are well known to cause impairments in blood flow and microcirculation. So in short, this study recruited five individuals to take a loading dose of 20 grams of creatine for just five days and either eat a really high carb meal or a really high fat meal. And it's well recognized that both high carb and high fat meals can cause, as I mentioned before, endothelial dysfunction, and it can compromise the circulatory system in your, your blood flow. And what they found is there was an amelioration or the creatine helped to prevent the high carb and high fat meals from compromising microcirculation, which as you know, poor microcirculation is an independent risk factor for, of course, uh, peripheral artery disease, endothelial dysfunction, erectile dysfunction, and probably cardiovascular disease globally. So I think it's important to recognize that if you eat fatty foods, we're talking pizza, we're talking French fries, ice cream, and these sorts of things, you shouldn't be doing this on a regular basis. But if you happen to do so, you might want to consider supplementing with creatine because it's been shown that creatine can actually improve blood flow or at least offset some of the meal-induced reductions in blood flow from having these high-fat or high-carbohydrate foods. If you want to learn more about this, we did a full deep dive on my YouTube channel. I'll link that in the description below.